All right, thank you. So I'm Jonathan Lilia Blog from Australia National University. My question is actually more of a legal question, and so perhaps perhaps this is for His Excellency Uthenu. But the discussion of federalism has an impact on the nature of law, right? And the nature and the treatment of federalism has an impact on the composition of the judiciary and then the application of laws. And so the example is in the United States system of federalism, there are two tracks of courts. There are state courts that deal with state laws, and then there are federal courts dealing with federal laws. So in the discussions that are happening right now with the NUCC and all of the discussions regarding federalism, I'm very curious as to has there been parallel discussions about the system of law that will result from the emerging Myanmar federal system. So thank you. Thank you for that question. Mr. Utenu. Thank you so much for your good question. So the, for me, yep, I agree with you. It's a nature of the law. That is, the uh, constitution is uh, based on the nature of the law, that, that we already accepted that. At the same time, what we are thinking about that the federalism is a uh, two parts. The, the one is the founder state, another is the founder government. Of course, the another two part is the, the human rights and the compositions of parliament compositions. That is, the four main part is very important to put in the, that constitution. The, at the same time, we also clarify that that the two level government system. The federal is two level government system combination. That is uh, that the federal level and the state level. So we can define uh, what is the detail of the, the legislative list of the, the, the federal, the constitution is very important. That is uh, what I mean is that the who will get that of the self-determination to the states. In that self-determination, what will be in guarantee by the constitution in the list? For example, you see that in the 1947 constitution, in the insisting June 1947, before that, that the general Aung is not passed away at that time. He already mentioned about the constitution, the five points clearly put it. One is that the Bahama must be the independent sovereign state. Second, uh, the all the, the state belongs to the, the, the self-determination. Number three, that uh, I mean uh, that the uh, sovereignty will derives from the people. And number four, to guarantee that that the human rights of the people. And number five is to guarantee the ethnic minorities that stay existing in, in our country. That is uh, that the constitution is divided for the five fights, fights parts in the 1947 constitution. The before he passed away on 19 July, it is it was stated on 16 June. 1947. So that is a, your, in your question, you see that we are also discussing on, on that, that, that the power sharing and resources sharing at the same time. For example, you see the, 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 the Marcus also explained that uh, we are starting from that uh, bottom up because that this constitution, that the uh, NUC constitution is not in much urgently now, but also based on the 19, 96, the first draft, the federal constitution, and also based on the second review draft federal constitution in 2008. There's two constitution also come up with, not just only the Bahman people, not just only drafted by the, I mean, top level, but also all are come from the, the, the bottom level, that the, the, all the ethnic minorities, I, I already say that some are the ethnic majority, but some other ethnic minority come together. And 102 organizations, some other ethnic organization belong to the ethnic. So we already dra drafted that two constitution in the past. So that is a, that NUCC constitution is mainly depend on the second draft constitution, the federal constitution. So that is a, you see that in that constitution, we already uh, agree that that uh, I mean the power sharing and resources sharing in that constitution, including that of the that uh, system of the that the federal levels, the, the code and the state level codes. So that is uh, what I wanted to say is yes, I agree with you, but uh, at the same time we already think about that and seriously, and we also have the serious discussion among 
the amounts that the barmen, majority barmen, and the, the non barmen ethnic nationality. So that is a, it is very important that the, what the power sharing would will have at the state level for the, the, the self-determination and the federal levels for the common interest is what to be put in the constitution. Thank you.